Well, the gannets continued to circle, and eventually we started to find some more specific action. The gannets began to dive quite heavily in one particular area, quite near Mzikaba. And beneath them, the sardine run continues, fish streaming past in unbelievable volume. Every now and again, a bunch of sardines would rise up towards the surface, balling up a little shallower than the rest. And this is when the gannets would just nail them. They could tell, probably because they were flying so high, they could see which parts of the shoal were shallower, and they would just rain down in a collective attack on the shallower portions of this big sardine shoal. Sardines would flee back to the bottom again and regroup, compressed down deep. These massive rafts of gannets sitting in front of the rocky coastline would rest for a moment digesting what they'd eaten and then take off again. Really battling to fly some of them, full of sardines, in pretty good condition now. They get airborne again into another attack cycle. A big ball of sardines now two or three kilometers long like a juggernaut just heading slowly north moving backwards and forwards along this rocky ledge Gannets regrouping overhead, individuals flying, diving down, hitting the surface of the ocean like a missile. And eventually, the numbers of gannets were so extreme, they were just covering the surface of the ocean. And I'd never seen gannets diving on any sort of scale like this. Taking off in massive flocks. Getting airborne again. And the attack on this shoal of sardines is just relentless. Raining down like hailstones. And the predator pressure on this shoal was just so extreme it actually stopped and began to move south again. Obviously huge fatalities, predators consuming quite big portions of, of the shoal and yeah the sardines taking a real hiding off from Zakaba today actually turning around and heading further south towards the end of the day <laughs> 